I love you, Zara. I love you, Zara. I love you. I love you. I love you, Zara. You Zara? Oh yeah. I love you, Zara. Goodbye, goodbye, Zara. Hello guys and welcome to a new video and as you guys saw that must have been the cutest most overwhelming moment I had in my entire gaming years. I mean I meet a lot of my viewers almost every day but that moment was extra special because that kid was like 6 or 7 years old max and the fact that he knows me and watches my videos means the world to me. And I felt so bad for killing him I just wished he opened his mic before we fought. It literally broke my heart. Anyway that was a special moment for me and I wanted to share it with you guys. Sadly I got killed in that game so today I'll show you another game gameplay instead and since it's a sad video I'm gonna have a sad gameplay too and you'll know why later on. I'm not sure when exactly I played this game but I think it's from the start of the season and it had many sweaty teams in it forcing me to play smart and plan my attacks carefully. I hope you guys enjoy, let's get started. Black Market never disappoints, I mostly get out with at least 4 kills from here. But I think everyone will forget about it next season because they're removing all the vending machines from it and it will be pretty much useless to land here. Next we're doing the usual, upgrade my skill and head towards the next airdrop. I don't know what that guy was thinking rushing me like that. I think he thought I was a noob, but he paid the price for it. Next I went for the second airdrop, got my fennec and that's where I met the rest of his squad. I was getting shot from different direction there so I bailed, switched my position and prepared for another attack. To be honest I could have taken that fight and won because I had high ground but I thought I was low in HP. I 
Again, another overconfident push from the same squad giving me an easy kill. Here I got high ground and waited for his squad because I know for a fact that they're gonna try to get his dog tag. I could have healed up and pushed him here but I didn't want to risk it because I don't have any info on their class and he could have defender class that's what they usually do wait for you to push them and next thing you know you're in heaven so I changed my position again and went for another attack I waited a bit for them to come and revive him again but this time I think they gave up on him and since the zone was pushing it was best to leave the area and start another attack inside the zone. The revived flight will arrive. If you're wondering why this squad was all over my ass, it's because they know me and they really wanted to kill me. And on top of that, I think I knocked all of them so they wanted revenge so badly. Again, I could have continued fighting here, but the dogs were so annoying. Airdrop incoming. Шоколадку купила, Гадіна, з'їла сама шоколадку, а я шо робить? 
А что, у меня, давайте, я когда есть шоколад, я тоже может хочу шоколад. Задумала мне, мне нужно шоколад. So now you know what I meant by sad gameplay. I feel like I played that game so well and I deserve to win. But I made a mistake. Because I should have had better awareness here and saw him pushing me. That way I could have reloaded my Fennec and I would have had a better chance to kill him. But overall I'm happy on how I played that game. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did, a like would be highly appreciated. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Everything, fire spreading up.